In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to select multiple files on a Chromebook so that you can select a big batch of files and then delete them, copy them, move them, and other things like that all at once, much more easily than if you did it one file at a time. And there are actually a few different ways to select multiple files on your Chromebook, and they can all be handy in different situations. So in this video, Timmy's going to show you all of them. So, when you're in the Files app on your Chromebook, probably the simplest way to select a few files is to click on the icon next to each file you want to select. So, you'll see there's a, a preview icon next to a picture. So, if you click on that preview icon, you get a tick here. And it might not be a preview icon, it might be something like this W for a Word document, or a PDF like that. So you just click on the icon next to the file and it will be selected. So now you can just keep clicking on as many icons as you want and all these files will be selected. And it might look a little bit different on your Chromebook if we just unselect all that. If you have your files laid out like this in thumbnail view instead of the list view that Timmy was using, it's pretty much the same. You just need to click on the icon here that's sort of inside the box of the file. So you can just click on those icons and that'll work very much the same. So that's really cool. But if you don't want to have to make sure you definitely click on that little icon and you just want to click on the file, you can actually do that by holding down the control key on your Chromebook. So just press and hold that down. And now you can click on any file you want and it will just be selected. So if you click on Pond and Cool Guy and this document and a PowerPoint and a video, all while you're holding down the control key, they will all be selected. And that can be quite handy as well. So both of those methods can be very handy if you just want to select a few specific files, but if you want to select a large chunk of files altogether and you don't want to have to click on every single one of them, there's an easy way to do that as well. All you need to do is click on the top file you want to select. So maybe Timmy wants to select these three document things here, so these two Word docs and the one PowerPoint presentation. You click on the top one here, so Timmy's done that just single click so it's highlighted. And then hold down the shift key on your keyboard. So hold that down. And then click on the bottom file you want to select. So Timmy will click on the PowerPoint presentation here. And now both the two files are selected, but everything in between is also selected. So this was a bit of a silly example because there's only three files, but if you clicked here and held down the shift key and clicked on this zip file here, it would select all those much more quickly and easily than if you clicked on them one at a time. And the final method Timmy's going to show you is selecting all the files. This method will be no good if you only want to select specific files, but if you want to select every single file in a certain folder, all you need to do is go into that folder so, as you can see, Timmy's here in the Downloads folder now. And then, in the folder, press Control A. So, hold down the Control key here, and press the letter A. And now, every file in the folder will be selected. It doesn't matter if you have hundreds of files in the folder, they'll all be selected that quickly and easily. So, if you ever need to select all the files in a folder, that can be really handy as well. And that's all there is to selecting multiple files on a Chromebook. So now that the files are selected, you could delete all five of these files by clicking on the delete button here, or you could share them with various apps by clicking on the share button. You could click on more here and copy them. So you could copy all these files and then you could click paste and then you could duplicate all these files 
or you could paste them in a different folder. So you'd have a copy of these files in this folder and another copy in a different folder, or you could zip the selection. So that would put all five of these files into a zip folder. And Timmy has a different video about zip folders on a Chromebook, which will be linked to in the description below. And you can also pin the files to a shelf. So if you clicked pin to shelf, that would put all the files down here. And then whenever you want them, you can just click here and easily access them. So that might be handy as well. And you can also select all these files like this and move them places. So if you had a flash drive or something connected to your Chromebook, you could select all these files and then drag them into the flash drive. Or if you wanted to put them in Google Drive, all you need to do is click one of the files and drag one of them and they'll all follow. So as you can see, there's five here. And now you can just drop it over in Google Drive or a flash drive or anything and it will copy the five files to that folder. So that can be really cool. If you want to copy or move a lot of files, you can select them all and drag them like that. And that's all there is to it. So hopefully you found this helpful. And if you want to see more helpful Chromebook tutorials like this, you'll find them all in a playlist here.